In this video, I am going to show you how to find your attachments when uploaded from Microsoft Outlook. Have you ever wondered where your attachments go when you save them from an email? I'm going to show you where they go. Here I have opened the new Outlook. Again, the new Outlook is something that Microsoft is transitioning into, so I do recommend turning the toggle on every now and again and just getting familiar with the layout and the feel of new Outlook. Here I have an email opened with an attachment here. If you click the drop down arrow next to the attachment, it gives you three options, preview, save to OneDrive, and download. If I click preview, this will open up a preview of the document attached to the email. From there, I also have three separate options. I can download from here. I can also print or save to OneDrive. From the drop down in the email, if you click download, that will automatically download. And then from your download section, you would be able to find that file here. And your third option in the drop down is save to OneDrive. And because you are already logged in, it'll automatically save to your Nassau BOCES OneDrive. So I'm going to click Save to OneDrive. Now the question is, where does it go when it's saved to OneDrive? So let's go into our OneDrive and find the attachment. I have open here my OneDrive on the Microsoft 365 web version, and I'm going to click My Files on the left-hand side. Here you are going to see all of your files and folders saved into your OneDrive. In order to find any attachment that you save to your OneDrive from Microsoft Outlook, you must click into the folder titled Attachments, which Microsoft automatically creates for you. So I'm going to click into that folder now. And here I will find that PDF attachment that I saved to my OneDrive from Microsoft Outlook. Even though it's automatically saved into your attachments folder, you still always have the option to move the file out of this attachment folder and into another folder or even into a Microsoft team. If you click the three dots, you have a bunch of options here on what to do with that file. You can easily share, copy the link, manage access if you need to share with others. And down here you can move to. So if you click move to, it opens up all of your files. And again, if you click on my files, you can choose a different folder that you may want to save that attachment in, in your OneDrive. You also have the option to create a new folder here, title it, and then move that file into that specific folder. I'm going to show you the options in the drop down menu in the classic Microsoft Outlook desktop application as well, because the options do look a little bit different. I now have opened the classic version of the Microsoft Outlook desktop application. Your options are a little bit different here. You have the option to preview, open in different locations, quick print, save as, save all attachments, and upload. So again, if you go to upload and then click on your OneDrive, here's where you would again find the attachment uploaded in your OneDrive under the attachment folder. You also have the ability to remove the attachment from the email and copy the attachment from the email right here. In the classic version of Outlook, if you click Save As, it will open your file explorer. So you do have the ability to choose which location you want to have that attachment saved. It won't directly go into the attachments folder. So that's another nice option that the classic version does have. Now you know how to find your attachments when uploaded from Microsoft Outlook. Stay tuned for next week's what the tech tip. See you then.